today on Becca's Butchery, I am mincing meat. I've got a mixer that has a grinding attachment. I just want to make sure everything's correct. And that goes tight in it. And here. And it goes in here. I've got my little chunks of um, semi frozen beef. What I always do is I mince the beef and then I season it and make meatballs or meat patties out of it, and there are hundreds of uses. Now I'm cutting the semi frozen beef into strips. I think it's so pleasant to cut semi-frozen beef because the knife goes this way so easily. Um, this requires a little bit of sawing, but that's one of the like, simple pleasures of life things. So enjoyable. Some meat here. And I get the meat to the to pack it the meat. This is quite some part. Meat and I'm weighing it. Make sure it's the right. So I finished packing six 500 gram bags of pork and I'm going to seal them later. What I'm doing now. <laughs> I've got a whole lot of minced pork and minced beef together. I'm gonna season it. I'm gonna show you how I season the basic ground meat filling thing that I use for just about everything else. First off, salt, pepper, and soy sauce. And then a lot of Italian herbs, so salt. dump all the pepper in the sauce. Now I'm going to taste the meat and see if it's salty or peppery enough. What I have here is a pound of uh, pig, uh, pork belly fat with the skin on it and I thought why not make some traditional lard to use in some uh, traditional recipes. So I'm popping it into a non-stick pan and I'm going to cook it so all the fat comes out and it's going to be delicious. I've got a little piece to start to cut out of the paper. I'm going to try and make a good clean block of lard. 